we've lost some of that with the loss of those three very talented seniors. Obviously, specifically, we're really going to miss their scoring. Uh, they were terrific scorers, all you know, all in their own right. Uh, Alani's great shooting, Jasmine's great pull-up game. Linda really fit the way we wanted to play with a slipping power forward. So um, you know, we have it's a little bit scary right now where the points are going to come from, and uh, that's the big question mark. But um, you know, they're they're practicing hard and they're getting better each and every day. But trying to win the day is a little bit of our motto: win the day and get better each day. Have you been kind of seeing maybe where some of those points are going to come from yet? You know, a lot of freshmen. Uh, I'm very talented to transfer in Tabitha. Gerardo, excited about local hero. Kayla Hall's, you know, finally being healthy. You know, she'll play in games this year for the first time since 2011. And so uh, glad to have her healthy. But uh, if you added up the points right now coming from our freshman class, it, it's an overwhelming sometimes uh, thought that uh, we're going to, you know, depend on so much freshman scoring, but uh, that's all a part of the process and all a part of our journey in rebuilding this program. How have the freshmen adjusted to playing Indiana basketball? You know, I'm excited, um, you know, that they, they fit in, they fit in with our style. Again, it's a freshman class that has great basketball IQ. They understand how to play the game. The thing that's the hardest transition for them is, is to understand the intensity the aggressiveness, um, you know, each and every possession that's needed to compete at the Big Ten level. They don't know that yet. They haven't experienced that yet. So we keep telling them that, but it's not, it's, it's hard to get to that point. What is the increasing attendance due to your attitudes on the court, like to the team? Well, no question, you know, some of our best games last year were our most uh, attended games, uh, attendance-wise. Uh, our best student body attended game was the Purdue game when we upset a nationally ranked team. That's not a coincidence. You know, they really thrive when their peers come out and, and fellow, you know, Indiana students come out and support them. So we really are looking forward to the student body coming out and support us. But we had a great increase in year one, but we're not done. This state appreciates basketball. It appreciates good basketball. Basketball means something, as I say all the time, to this state. So we know as we get better and better and put a better product on the floor, we have the ability to continue to keep increasing that fan base. Uh, it's all process. Again, uh, we're not exactly where we want to be. We may not be for another couple years, but uh, it's a fun time to jump on board and support this program. There's a buzz. Something's happening with this program, and it's going in the right direction.